Do you recognize this week's chalk art? It looks a little familiar. We might get a little messy today, but just the right amount of messy to have fun. Hey guys, Ray Pahar from Get Crafty Crafty, and today we're going to be doing something a little different. Instead of doing a completely new DIY project, we're going to be revisiting one of the older projects that I did about a year ago. If you haven't already, make sure you check out the video right over here, Painting with Shaving Cream. And this is probably one of the first projects that I was really excited about just because it was featured on redtricycle.com. If you guys weren't able to check it out back then, you guys can check it out now. I'll have the link to that in the description below. I figured this is a really great way for you guys to revisit this old project and show you some of the new techniques that I have on an old project. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this. Let's go ahead and get started with today's project. The items that you'll need for today's project include shaving cream, large popsicle sticks, painter's tape, liquid watercolor. I'll have links to this in the description below. If you don't have liquid watercolor, you could use food coloring as an alternative, a disposable tray, and some envelopes, and some cardstock. To start off this project, you want to use your blue tape to block off any parts of your cardstock or your envelope that you want to prevent from touching any of the shaving cream. You can do this or you can leave it blank depending on the design that you're going for. Before you start to work with your shaving cream, you want to set up a drying area on the side of your workspace. I set up some butcher paper on the side so that I would have an area for the shaving cream to dry off. Compared to our last video, instead of making individual trays of shaving cream, we're going to apply our shaving cream into one large tray. Create a layer of shaving cream that's about one inch deep. Using your liquid watercolor, you want to gently scatter your color throughout your shaving cream. If you're using food coloring, you might want to use a small amount just because it's a little more concentrated compared to liquid watercolor. Using a popsicle stick, you want to gently swirl around your colors to create the swirl pattern for your shaving cream. Carefully take your envelope or your cardstock and place it right on top of your shaving cream to capture the pattern. Carefully remove it from the shaving cream to reveal your pattern. You can do this multiple times to get multiple patterns. To remove the excess shaving cream, you're going to place your envelope or your cardstock onto your butcher paper and then using your popsicle stick, you're just going to shave it right off. It should only take a few minutes for your shaving cream and your watercolor to completely dry off. Once it's dried, remove your blue tape to reveal your pattern. As you guys can see, this is a really easy project to get carried away with just because it's so easy to take your stationery, place it into your shaving cream, and make something completely new out of some simple materials. Uh, depending on the amount of times that you actually use the shaving cream, you might get some uh, extra pieces of watercolor onto your stationery, just because it does get a little messy, but I feel like it adds a little bit of character onto your, onto your prints. Uh, this is a great project to do with all ages and you can do this both indoors and outdoors and I probably would suggest doing it outdoors if you're doing this with a huge group of kids just because it does get a little messy. If you guys do make this project, make sure you share it with me either on my Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter using the Get Crafty Crafty hashtag and you check out our last two videos which were the Steven Universe ukulele and our time lapse number three. I'm gonna go and probably make more prints just because I have everything laid out already. I'll see you guys next time and yeah, stay crafty and take care.